Embracing imagination as the ultimate reality unlocks the key to expediting your manifestations. It dissolves worries and problems, freeing you from the need for validation from others. Every object or circumstance present in your physical world was once born from your imagination and emotions, even if you were unaware of it at the time. It's crucial to recognize that energy follows attention, and how you perceive others influences their behavior. The external world mirrors the images and scenarios that exist within your mind's eye. If we accept that everything in our 3D reality stems from our imagination, then imagination becomes the sole truth. Our possessions and the attitudes of those around us were once imagined and felt before materializing in our physical reality. Thus, the external world reflects our internal world. To seek validation from others, simply imagine and feel as though you already possess it. This will manifest in your external reality. There is no need to convince yourself of something you don't have yet. Instead, acknowledge that your desires already exist within your imagination. Whether it's a marriage, a car, a house, or anything else, it already resides within you. Once you accept this truth and genuinely feel the reality of your desires, you no longer have to strive to manifest them. Why? Because you have already acquired them in your imagination, and imagination is the ultimate reality. The creative force of God resides within you in the form of your marvelous human imagination. It possesses the potential to rescue you from any situation you may face. Just as water quenches thirst and employment provides financial stability, through your imagination, you can bring forth your deepest desires. There are no limits to what you can achieve with your imagination. If you can conceive it, you can achieve it. To utilize your imagination in a creative manner, start by finding a comfortable spot to sit or lie down and close your eyes. Identify what you desire to experience. Once determined, fully relax and bring to mind the end result of your desire. For example, if your goal is to attain a promotion at work, imagine the end result where your colleagues congratulate you, you move to a larger office, and receive a pay increase. Pick one of these events and with closed eyes, immerse yourself entirely in the experience. Imagine hearing your friends congratulating you and feel the sensation of their hand in yours as they express their happiness for you. By genuinely experiencing the feeling of being congratulated, your imagination begins working towards bringing that state into your reality. Don't worry about how your imagination will bring about your desires. Your imagination will employ whatever natural means necessary to manifest them. However, events unfold in the physical world within a time sequence, so it may take some time for your desired outcome to materialize. After using your imagination to create your desired outcome, continue with your daily life while maintaining a positive mindset that your desire is on its way to you. Keep your thoughts and inner conversations aligned with the visualized outcome. You have already planted the seed, and soon you will reap the fruits of your efforts. When entering your imagination, actively engage in the action. Hear the words, touch the object, or smell the aroma in your self-created scene. Your imagination is not merely a passive daydream where you observe events in your mind's eye. You must immerse yourself in the dream as if you were physically present. Make the future now and bring the distant here. For instance, if you desire a new car, imagine yourself driving it. Don't just see the car in your mind's eye, enter the dream fully. Feel the steering wheel in your hands, inhale the new car scent, and experience the pleasure of a comfortable ride. Allow yourself to feel the joy and contentment you would experience once your dream becomes a reality. What you feel and experience in your imagination is a genuine act of creation that exists in the fourth dimension and will manifest in the physical world, just as planting a seed leads to the growth of a specific plant. After planting the seed of your desire in your imagination, avoid disturbing it by worrying about the methods that will be used to bring it to fruition. Every desire has its own timeline for realization. Some goals may manifest quickly, while others may take longer to materialize. Once you have imagined and felt your desired outcome, Trust that it will come to fruition in your reality. Your imagination has the power to attract all the necessary resources and individuals to bring your dream to life. If other people are needed to play a role in the manifestation process, your imagination will draw them into your story. Your job is to stay true to your imagined scene until it becomes a tangible reality in your external world. You can choose to perform your imaginal act repeatedly before going to bed each night. You may even want to do this until it feels like a natural and normal part of your nightly routine. While your conscious mind is at rest, 
your imagination will be working out the necessary steps to achieve your desire. It's important to engage all five of your senses when practicing this exercise. Whether it's hearing a friend's voice congratulating you or feeling the warmth of their embrace, by doing so, you bring your imagination to life, making your dream more tangible and achievable. To achieve your desire, persevere and maintain a constant focus on it. Continue to imagine the end result until it becomes a reality. There is no need for you to take action unless you are naturally prompted to do so. God is the one doing the work and knows the best way to make it happen. Whenever you think about your desire during the day, express gratitude because it has already come to fruition. Imagine a reality that surpasses your highest expectations.